Mr. Bandit 81 here, aka the Sci Fi Bandit, with a build review out of the Harry Potter Build Your Own Adventure Book. Now, this was a fun build to work on, or I should say two builds, but it's pretty much the same thing, or build, builds. Uh, you'll see what I mean here shortly. The builds are pretty much the bookshelves from the library. Though, the ones I put together won't have the uh, chains on them. Well, one of the two, look at it. Well, the two shelves don't have the uh, chains on them like uh, this one does. But I uh, figured I'd have fun putting together two different bookshelves just for fun. And using what bricks I had out. It made for an interesting build. Like some of the other builds reviewed so far from the Ninjago one. This one, or the... This build happens to be just as colorful in spots as the other builds. Pretty much a fun day of building. And let's take a look at the builds right now. Here are the builds themselves with Ron, Harry, and Hermione both with the builds. Figured the uh, have some fun setting these characters up with the bookshelves. And for a little tidbit, taking a bunch of uh, these books here. with, uh, as they are, making part of the library. About two of them do have uh, images on the cover, so it's going to mix or add some extra detail in with what's seen. As well as two other books being mixed in. Just uh, flip them over and around. And adding some extra books to the location. For some extra details. With that out of the way. In a good way. Let's take a look at the uh, bookshelves. First one up. Using uh, these base plates again. Giving uh, <laughs> something for the bookshelves to be standing on. Plus... Adding to the library having more than one bookshelf set up. Now, uh, for some of the bookshelves here, I've using a, a one by two brick with uh, studs on the sides. 
was able to uh, give uh, this row book a well, be able to stay in place. Well, this brick here has studs on both sides, one holding the shield up as well as these books. These pretty much being uh, base plates with uh, you know that just connect together and one two by four brick to act like a very big book. Yeah, I, <coughs> I did add an extra base plate to this though to make it look like something was underneath the books. That one being Jurassic World. Just uh, slid the uh, bricks in place. And you have some books on the shelf. Did add, well, something else from the book shown was adding something like this here to uh, place some books on. For a little extra display now this one as you've noticed does have some details from the book sh shown in it as I mentioned before there's uh, no chains hanging down from them I guess that would be the uh, restricted bookshelves or books that can't leave the library, perhaps. I did, as you can see, add uh, an owl to part of the library, as well as a possible artifact. Hmm. Could put a little flame on top to make it seem like a candle, perhaps, but I thought I'd just toss you know, two, uh, two random items in for fun. Uh, same as before, two by four bricks or tile plates with, uh, <coughs> excuse me, with uh, studs on them, hold them in place. One of which being a regular tile piece, as seen like this one here. Bricks uh, with studs on the side holding them in place. And as mentioned before, some books with uh, print on them, on the covers. Giving uh, the book itself uh, some extra detail. Two of which are from the Friends, Lego Friends line. So, definitely uh, gives the books some extra detail. Just for fun. some lanterns on each side of the bookshelf giving some light inside the library in case it's a real cloudy day or getting dark outside and as before a little shelf here for displaying a book Now this one doesn't have a, a brick on it, 
with both the studs on both sides to hold the shield like uh, this one does but other than that the uh, floating books or arms holding the books up it does add some detail to it so if you happen to have a good collection of the Harry Potter characters you can definitely set them up make it seem like they're doing some research for a school project or looking something up for something that's going on or <laughs> better yet if you wanted something for uh, the explorer doing some more research on a topic or maybe something for sensei Wu and his ninjas possible adventure there uh, hope I've given you some ideas for your own uh, library build setup I'm sure you, you'll be coming up with some interesting adventures or builds to place whatever character or character is up in so until next time take it easy and have fun building